it when you set a palm pre it's gonna take a while so you got five minutes go take a smoke go take a drink whatever you need um, once that comes back on then you're ready you're ready to, to start putting stuff over um, connect your uh, palm pr uh, palm pre to your computer and when you do this don't go to USB drive go to just charge and that's it now your your palm, your palm pre is prepared now now back on your computer this should pop up now if it says uh, device not detected or anything that means that you didn't plug it in and you didn't do the developers code you do the developers code turn that on you plug it in and it should order it should detect it and then what you want to do is you want to go to here click this this little um, arrow pointing down to a hard drive now I let this load up it's gonna I mean it's for you since it's gonna be first time running it's gonna take a little while once that runs up what you want to do is there's a block right here I don't know if you can see it but anyway it's a drop down menu and what you want to do is you want to go to web OS internals feed all click on that and the first thing you want to do is click on the check mark on this one on package manager service and what that's going to do is that's going to allow you to run preware underneath it but you don't want to do that just yet you want to do them separately for right now what you want to do is after you click that, click download, which I already did, so I don't need to do it. Once you click download, it's going to download it into here. It's going to download it into here. You're going to see it right here. And then you click install. And it's going to install into your Palm Pre. Now, that's it. Now, that's just one thing. Now, you got to come back after that's installed. Once this disappears, it's in your Palm Pre. Come back over here. Well, oh, see, I, I, see, that's what happens whenever you don't have it connected I'm gonna reconnect it because I just connected it disconnected it by accident anyway go to uh, just charge and then okay connect press ok now no more errors you wanna go back to here click this let it load click on the drop down menu go back to this web and OS internal feed all then you wanna click on this preware click on preware download which I'm not going to download because I already downloaded it. It's going to show up right here. Click install. Now, it's going to install in there and it's going to show up in your pre. Okay, now that you got preware on here, you're going to see it's going to be in your launcher. It's going to be in the first page all the way at the bottom. It's going to look like that. Right there, pre-wear. When you click on it, it takes a while to load, so I've uh, I've already did that for you. Uh, load, load it loaded up, so you don't have to wait. Uh, and you, right here, you're gonna see uh, package updates, uh, applications, themes, patches, packages. They're pretty much all the same thing, uh, but you don't have to take off the applications. A little on that later, but anyway, what you want to do is you want to go to applications, and then up in here, go to all. And then right here, what you want to do is you want to open up the your keyboard and, and type in Luna, L-U-N-A, Manager. Well, before you even get to Manager, it's, it's going to pop up. Now, it doesn't pop up for me because I've already got it installed. Uh, you want to you want to load that up. And what this app does is it allows you to re uh, with a push of a button. It allows you to restart just the UI uh, and once you put like that's for like patches when you put a patch on instead of a uh, re um, rebooting your whole pre uh, it's gonna allow you just to redo the UI and uh, it's very helpful and very useful now whenever you put a patch in it's not gonna show up right away you have to reset you have to reboot your, uh, your UI your user interface and uh, uh, what you're gonna do is after you do that uh, say you go, you, you load that up, uh, and then you, you're ready to go put some patches. Let's go put some patches. You go to patch. Now, let's go with just a, one right quick. It, it right there, you can see. Now, if you go to any one of these, they're going to tell you what the patch means. 
Uh, now, see, if some of them are pretty much self-explanatory. If you don't like that, uh, the NASCAR app tells you to hide it, which I already installed it because I don't like a NASCAR. Uh, not that I don't like it, but I don't watch it and I don't care for it. So anyway, uh, come down, you uh, you got the 5. This is what I have. I have the 5x4 Icons version 1. Uh, actually, it was version 2. Uh, no, it's the 4. My bad. I'm sorry. Uh, anyway, uh, it, it tells you what, what, what it does. See, rather than 3x4, it's 5x4. It's five so once you do that, you can even click on the... Uh, you know the screenshot to see what it does and there you go that's what it does <laughs> uh, pretty much self-explanatory all of these are pretty much self-explanatory if there's something that you want to get and you don't know where to look go to all and of course you can do uh, by newer by the newest uh, ones these are the newest ones at the top that, that was loaded today or if you want to go alphabetical order just click the A through Z or better yet if you want to do this just type in what you're looking for. Say like uh, a lot of people want the uh, the virtual keyboard so just type in virtual which of course it's not going to show up because I've already got it installed but you just type in virtual keyboard and bam it's going to pop up you click it install it bam you're done. Uh, I'm going to show you how that works in a little bit too. Um, other than that that's pretty much it you're, you're, you're done you're set uh, just go through each one and, and try it out and see uh, very useful uh, patches and, and apps and everything and I want to take this time out too right now to thank Rod for making the uh, the very simple easy step-by-step -step instructions at precentral.net uh, it, it helped me to do this tutorial to other people that don't understand or you know understand what 